Well, good morning. It is finally Friday, and if you've been inside all week, unfortunately today, not going to be the best to get out there and get that fresh air. It's going to be pretty raw today with uh, colder temperatures and some pretty gusty winds. Live look in Jackson where it's dry right now. We had some rain move through earlier, still seeing a little bit of some mist hanging on on the south side of Lansing, but the rain for the most part is on its way out. Satellite and radar showing you if we do have any showers, they're moving far off to the east, kind of closer to portions of the thumb. Cold front currently working its way through the state behind this is colder temperatures, some gusty winds, but also high pressure. So if it's going to be a little bit colder today, at least we'll see some sunshine by later this afternoon. Temperatures, though, already starting to fall pretty quickly. 47 degrees currently in Lansing, still warm in Jackson, 59 degrees there, 44 currently in Ionia. Temperatures are only going to be getting colder today, unfortunately, instead of warmer. Your predicted temperatures by the time we hit the lunch hour down into the low 40s, eventually into the 30s by about 4 o'clock this afternoon. And when you factor in the wind, it's going to feel even colder. Winds also going to be increasing today. Right now they're coming in more from the northwest northwest at about 10 to 15 miles per hour. These two are expected to turn coming in from the northwest and increase anywhere between about 15 to 25 mile per hour sustained winds pretty much throughout the entire day and 20 mile per hour winds are going to make the 30s feel more like the 20s outside. So it is going to feel again a little bit on the brisk side for our first official full day of spring. Your future track as we go hour by hour. Do expect to see some scattered showers at least through about 9 o'clock this morning. After that will be dry and we'll see clearing skies take place. So there will be sunshine by later today. But again, when you factor in the wind and those colder temperatures, it's going to feel a little bit more like winter and that feel will continue even into the weekend. Saturday will have plenty of sunshine. Highs will be into the mid 30s. Our saving grace tomorrow is the fact that the wind should start to diminish, so it won't feel really quite as quite as cold as what it's going to feel like today. We really won't have as much of a wind chill tomorrow. Sunday will be just a little bit warmer with highs in the mid 40s, but Sunday night into Monday, a disturbance passes by. We could see some light snow Sunday night. Thankfully, those should all melt by Monday when temperatures warm up. Today we've already seen our high of 54 temperatures fall from here. It will be windy. Northwest winds at 15 to 25 miles an hour with mostly cloudy skies turning partly cloudy later today. We eventually clear out overnight a low of 19 degrees though and it stays breezy with the north wind at 10 to 20 miles an hour. In your seven day forecast, the weekend looks nice, but it's going to feel a lot more like winter. 36 and sunny Saturday, 41, partly cloudy Sunday, some light snow Sunday night. It all melts on Monday, though, a high of 49 degrees and then feeling more like spring next week with highs in the 50s. All right. Well, right now, 